In this tutorial, let's explore advanced scene creation with conditionals using Josh. To begin, if you haven't watched our basic scene creation tutorial, please click on the video on the screen or find the link in the description below. We are going to use some of what was learned in that tutorial here today, so save yourself some time and check it out first. However, today we'll be crafting a TV time scene using conditionals in our advanced editor. You may ask, what are conditionals? Well, conditionals allow you to create scenes that react differently based on factors like weather, time of day, or even the season. While you can achieve this using our Triggers tab in the Scene Editor, Josh's Advanced Scene Editor lets you respond one way if a condition is met and differently if it's not. This is not something you can do without natural language programming. Now, let's jump into creating a scene with some conditionals. First, open the Josh app and go to the Scenes tab. Click on the New Scene button. Give it a name or select a default name. Then click into the Advanced Editor for Advanced Scripting. To preface, the devices in the scenes I am creating can be interchanged with whatever you have in your home. Also, don't be afraid to play around with it. There are some pretty cool things you can do in this editor. But now, let's get back to the scene. We will use the Quick Action button to create a time-based conditional scene. Select the time-based conditional. Now, you can use this prompt to add your criteria in. For this example, we will adjust the den's lighting so replace where it says Action 1 with Set the Den's Lights to 35% Brightness. Then, let's set the second action to Open the Den Shades. Finally, let's close the Den Shades and set the Den Lights to 50% Brightness. Something to keep in mind for typing scene actions in the scene editor, you need to specify each action's location for the request to be properly processed. In this scene, we set up a basic time conditional. If it is before noon, the action is to turn the den lights to 35% brightness. If it's between noon and 4 p.m., the den shades will open. And after 4 p.m., the lights will be set to 50% brightness and the shades will close. This is the foundation of creating dynamic scenes based on specific conditions. Now, save your scene and give it a test run to observe how it responds to the time-based condition. Lastly, let's add some triggers that we learned in the previous scene tutorial to make this just a bit more dynamic. Head over to the Triggers tab and select When a Device State Changes. Choose Video, then select our Den TV and finally hit Save. Now, our advanced time-based conditional scene will trigger every time the TV turns on with a different outcome based on the time of day. I hope that was as fun for you as it was for us. That's it for this tutorial. We trust this guide on how to use conditionals in the advanced editor was informative and inspiring. Give it a try and stay tuned for more Josh tips to enjoy your home intelligence experience to the fullest.